What's going on everybody? I'm your host, The Humble Savage, and welcome to The Recap. What's going on everybody? As stated, I'm your host, The Humble Savage, and welcome to this week's episode of The Recap. We are covering Q4 in this one. Been slow on these videos, so without further ado, let's jump right into it. I'm excited for Q4 because in Q4, we've got some new names on the board out there. First rider, Jeff. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Jeff has been around for a minute. He's always supported Sorrel. Um, we had some issues on the phones, and I'm actually going to go over a fix in the next video um, when I prepare all the images and whatnot to show you guys because on some of the phones, your security settings might be shortening the beginning and ends of your ride so that way people don't know where you start say you start riding from home um, it's a security measure I get it but it messes up the segments on your phone it will look like you completed a segment but when I go look or anybody else looks you will not see the segment because we can't see the beginning and end of the run so we got Jeff all fixed and squared away now he on the board we backtracked all the way to the beginning of the season too with this so Jeff wasn't the only one. His son, Zach, was also, and my boy John, um, Farmer John, he was another one that had this issue. So we fixed their phones, backtracked the seasons. So when you start to see the standings, you're going to notice that there's more points in some areas that weren't there in previous video. Um, I explained this on an Instagram story as well. Being transparent with you guys, I'll let you know it ain't no shysty stuff going on. We want to give everybody their fair chance and opportunity. So if I could fix their issue and on their phones, I wanted to do it and clock their points. So Jeff got some points. He hit Black Run Preserve and got on the board. And next to mine, we got the homie John. Now this was a, this was a quarter I believe that the weather was getting at us. I think there was some some rainy days that kept us from getting out. Um, so you're going to see some lower numbers from some people that uh, usually have a little higher numbers up there. Dave. Dave came up from Virginia. He is our first out-of-state rider. Let's give it up for Dave. Um, he went out, I showed him Rancocas, and he had an absolute blast tearing down the segments over there. Um, Rancocas Northside is a fun place to go ride. Lots of segments in like a little condensed area. And it's a good place to train. You can really go out and train your numbers when it comes to a short course. Or if you want to hit a couple long ones, there's a couple long ones there too. We got Zach. Zach hitting that Rancocas. That's local for him. Um, so look out for Zach. Zach is now. I will say the place settings on here are just for this quarter that you see down in the bottom right corner. It's how you sat for quarter four. We're going to get to the final in a second. And then I hit the usual bounce around spots that I go to. Still got a one Grom. He didn't get out and hit any more right yet, but hopefully he'll be out soon um, to get out there again. Got plenty of quarters left. And hope he bounces out and gets on some more sorrow segments. Uh, but he's still holding strong as our only Grom in first place. So, um, Martin, if you got any friends, talk to him about One Wheel Man. Let him know. We need him. And here we have the final standings. So, as I said before, you'll notice that there's points that were entered in Q1. Uh, that were not there before, uh, purely because of the fact that the phones had an issue. Um, there was even an update to points, because what would happen is, since it would truncate the beginning of the ride, when we'd have a couple group rides that ran Cocos, if you just kept your phone running, after a while it would pick up whatever segments you did after that first like quarter mile of security buffer. So some things would register, and we would get points up there, but we had to add more points for some people, because... We got their phone fixed. You'll also notice some other names at the bottoms of this list. They are to come in Q5. 
Um, we had some other people bounce out and get some segments. Shout out to Matty Ice. He's another homie who came in from Long Island. You will see him in Q5. And um, Jeremy, he's back. He's back. That's right. The dog is back. He's another one of my Clydesdale homies out here, man. Um, he's out there battling it out with me. So that way we can go against these light guys and, you know, try to be as fast as we can. But anyway, I'm rambling now. And as you can see, the homie Farmer John is up there, too. He, he about to get out there and get on some segments, too. He, he wants some sorrow. Um, Veskin on us, okay? So be on the lookout. Veskin on us. But, yeah, those are the points for Q4. Um, Should have done this in the beginning. My apologies. Shout out to all our sponsors, all of them. All of them, all of them. I love you all. Appreciate you all. From the companies to the individual contributors who donated financial funding, so that way we can, you know, do prizes and whatnot. You are much appreciated and much loved. Um, until next time, stay humble, stay hungry, and you'll always remain humbly savage. See you in the next one. Ooh, before we go, be safe out there. Remember, you are riding at your own risk. Peace out, y'all.